Today, I'm introducing to you guys 10 of the best games that you could play right now on Bluestacks. That's right, if you're looking to use an emulator for your mobile games, consider using Bluestacks. Every single game that I'm bringing to you guys today, I enjoy, I have played, and is linked down below. Utilize those links, download the games for free. They're my personal codes. We have some great games, guys. Let's jump into them. On today's list is Marvel Strike Force, which is one of the leaders in the turn-based RPG games. I know that many of you are in love with the Marvel characters, and this game has a ton of them to choose from. Every single Marvel character that you have ever seen inside of the Marvel world will be here for you to play with, upgrade, build your teams, and battle against your enemies. You can even work together with your alliance mates to take on other alliances and dominate. There's so much customization of available within this game, the one you have to try. And one of my favorite things about this game is the artwork, how colorful and how great everything looks, but what else would you expect from the Marvel world. You have to let me know, guys, which one of the characters is your favorite, which one can you not wait to play with. Again, link to this game is down below. The second game on today's list is Dragon Champions, which very much like Marvel Strike Force is another turn-based strategy game, another RPG game. For this game, you can download it either on your phone or via Bluestacks. Both of those are linked down below. Plus, in addition, if you use code Echo Gift inside of the game, you can get your $10 worth of free heroes and rewards. So that's a great start. Dragon Champions is another one on the list today that is just like Marvel Strike Force. Here, you're gonna choose your heroes, be able to upgrade them. The customization is insane. And the artwork reminds me very much of something coming from a Blizzard game, which this is not a Blizzard game, but it really does give me that World of Warcraft feel. Such a great looking game that offers a bunch of different heroes that you can combine together so that you can enjoy the game and dominate taking down dragons, enemies, and PvP elements along the way. So much fun. Link down below in two different ways. Remember, use code Echo Gift. Number three on today's list is Rise of Kingdoms Lost Crusade, a power-based strategy game that I've covered a lot on my channel. In Rise of Kingdoms, you're going to be building your fortress, building your city, upgrading yourself to level 25, unlocking your heroes, and then upgrading them as well. The more powerful you are, the stronger you're going to be against your enemies, and the better chance you're going to have to dominate inside of this game. If you like power, if you like war, and if you like working with friends to take down your enemies and everyone that surrounds you, Rise of Kingdoms could be an excellent choice for you. Being able to choose different civilizations are going to give you different buffs inside of the game from your start you're getting inside of a game that really has a lot of history in it so if you're into that type of thing well this is another reason why rise of kingdoms is a good opportunity for you to play it's definitely a lot of fun but takes a big time commitment as well so if you're looking for a game that's got three minute rounds rise of kingdoms is probably not yours but if you're looking for a deep in-depth and vast gaming experience consider playing rise of kingdoms unlocking legendary hero legendary heroes like you see right here in julius caesar and just enjoying the game but when you see red as you do in this image right here you know that you were in trouble and you'll be attacked so make sure you get your alliance mates there to protect you so you can prosper. Number three on today's list needs no introduction, but is Call of Duty Mobile brought to us by Activision. And this is one of the best action games on mobile and on Bluestacks right now. Now, if you're anything like me, you've played Call of Duty on console or on PC for years, but now you're able to take that experience onto your phone. The gameplay is that that you will remember from the past. It's amazing. The graphics are on point and the controls are as good as you can get on mobile devices. This game is so much fun. It's by far my favorite action game right now on mobile, but you can also play it on Bluestacks as well, which enables you to use those keyboard and mouse controls. COD Mobile also also continuously updates their game. Currently, the night mode is something that's pretty hot inside of the game, but they're always bringing new events, new elements, new skins, new weapons, and things that you can unlock for free. And no one loves a game better on mobile than one that you could be free to play and have the same advantage or the same playing field as someone that's deciding to pay for it. 
and get different weapons or get different skins. Call of Duty Mobile, a leader in its class. If you haven't tried it, you definitely need to. And today is that day. Let me know down below if you are already playing COD Mobile. And if not, what you think of it when you finally give it a download. Guys, if you want to talk more about mobile games, consider coming through my Discord server. It's linked down below as well as the pinned comment. I'll be waiting there for you guys to talk more about mobile games that we love. Number five on today's list is State of Survival, which is a lot like Rise of Kingdoms, where you're building power and you are building up your civilization. But here, you have to fight zombies. Not only are you going to be playing against zombies, saving your city from these zombies and working together with your teammates, but you're gonna have the ability to unlock amazing commanders inside of the game, which you can upgrade and basically make fit your play style. If you like playing a certain way, you can upgrade commanders that fit and that will promote that type of gameplay. This game is a ton of fun, another one that's a big time investment, but if you're looking for that game that you could play and spend a lot of time in and really invest yourself as a gamer into it, State of Survival, one you should check out. And the artwork is pretty on point, really giving you the feel that you're stuck in a post-apocalyptic world, trying to survive from all these zombies, but you need to remember, it's not only zombies you have to worry about, but the other players. Number six on today's list is Disney Sorcerer's Arena, which is fun. And it's another one of those turn-based RPGs that you should try. And I mean, who doesn't love a little bit of Disney in their life? We all remember those days, or maybe you wanna play this one with your kids. Turn-based strategy game that's completely taking in the love that we all have for Disney. Choose your favorite characters as you would in the others, give them a shot and see if your kids would like playing along with you if you happen to be a parent. A really fun game that just brings in that Disney element. You could battle in some PVP using Ursula or maybe you wanna just be collecting all of the different characters that you can. I mean, we are talking about a hero collector here, guys. And once you get the team that you are ready to go to battle with, you will dominate like Magic Mickey is telling us right here. But it's all about teamwork. You gotta hook up with your teammates, work together, and really enjoy the end game here in Disney Sorcerer's Arena. Coming in at number seven, we have A3 Still Alive, which is gonna satisfy your action RPG needs. If you like hacking and slashing, action RPGs, and you like mobile games, a3 is the one for you. Yes, Diablo Immortal is incoming. And by the way, I have a second channel for Diablo Immortal called Echo Gaming Diablo. Go check it out. This is one that could hold you over in the meantime, not only doing what we typically know from action RPGs, but also implementing a battle royale mode that's so much fun. The graphics are standard from what we're used to and the combat is pretty natural feeling. It actually works really well on mobile, but the highlight of this game is like I said, that battle royale mode, which we've never seen before on action RPG mobile games. So it's bringing something brand new to the scene. If you haven't tried out that game mode in this genre, it's something you just have to do. You have to test it out and see if it's something that you're into. Battle these big monsters with a control scheme that you're probably already comfortable with. It's worth giving a shot. It's a lot of fun. And it's something that you could play while you wait for Diablo Immortal. So how do we talk about turn-based RPGs without mentioning Raid Shadow Legends? Coming in at number eight on today's list is just that, Raid Shadow Legends. And this is going to take you into a fantasy world with graphics that are pretty on point if I say so myself. Raid Shadow Get Legends gets a lot of hate for the advertising campaigns that they do, but at the end of the day, it's an extremely fun game to play. Another one of your turn-based strategy games with really diverse characters, as you can see on the screen right now. The bosses are OP another one of those turn-based strategies that's on today's list. I believe we actually have four of them here today. This being probably the most popular of all of them on the list. But I want to remind you, being the most popular doesn't mean that it's the best. And I am not saying that Raid Shadow Legends is not solid because it is an amazing game, but that does not make anything that we mentioned earlier less of a game. It just happens to be less po popular. Marvel Strike Force, Dragon Champions, even the Disney one we mentioned before. All solid games within this genre, and you could try them all. Give them all a shot. See which one fits your play style the most. See which one you just feel the most comfortable playing, and then that could be the one that you invest your time into. You don't need to make a decision after watching this video and not trying them all out. Give them all a shot. See which one you like. At number nine, we have Shop Titans, which is a nice idle game that you're gonna be simulating the development of a city, the progression of your characters as well. 
Now, Shop Titans may look a little bit cartoony to you, but don't worry. This game is a ton of fun. The customization options are on point, and this is an extremely popular game on mobile. I believe it's even on Steam and on Bluestacks. So really, guys, one that you ought to give an opportunity to if you like leveling up your city, leveling up your characters, and building them out to perform the way that you want. It's a lot of fun, different than any other game from today's list, and you know, maybe you'll like it. And again, within this genre, you worry and you focus on your crafting, crafting your gear, crafting your weapons. Of course, you're gonna be collecting loot. That's just how we do on the mobile platform. And you're gonna join a guild so that you could play with others. Remember, these games really thrive on the ability to play with friends. And then you get to build up your fantasy shop and even get a pet. I mean, come on. If you can get a pet, why wouldn't you want to play this game? It's on point. I think you'll enjoy it. And the final game on today's list is Identity 5, a game that's scary and needed to be on the list. And you need to ask yourself, are you a hunter or a survivor? You're going to be the hunter trying to hunt down the four survivors that are there on the map or a survivor trying to decipher and decode to get the gates open and escape. But look at these puppets. These characters are all really creepy looking. And when you play, it kind of brings you into this scary and creepy world. And it's going to make you look over your shoulder when you're trying to get out of the world. Unless if you're the hunter, then maybe you'll feel a little bit more comfortable. Now, Identity 5 is not a brand new game, but it's one that I've played a lot on the channel and really did enjoy when I did. It's the only horror style game that we have on today's list, and I really think it's deserving. Again, it's great because this game is available not only on mobile, but also on Bluestacks if you'd rather play on your computer. Whether it be Marvel Strike Force, Dragon Champions, Rise of Kingdoms, COD Mobile, State of Survival, Disney's Sorcerer's Arena, A3 Still Alive, Raid Shadow Legends, Shop Titans or Identity 5, there is a game on today's list that you will enjoy. Again, I urge you to use the links down below to test these ones out. It costs you nothing and it can only bring you hours of fun ahead. Thank you guys so much for tuning into today's video. Let me know in the comments section below what games you're playing right now that you are loving. Maybe I'll check them out and maybe they can be featured in an upcoming video. And again, if you want to talk more about games or more about anything, really, my Discord server is the place for that. Come on through. It's linked down below plus part of the pinned comment. But thank you so much for coming today, guys. I appreciate you. Make sure you check out some of my other videos before you go. And be good.